Recently, I was unable to connect my iPhone to the CarPlay and the error was that pairing failed. Please check passkey and device status. And guys, to be honest, this error I saw first time and didn't know what to do. So I tried multiple basic things, whatever I could think of. For example, first of all, I disabled Bluetooth. I removed my CarPlay or Car from the device list. Also, I disabled and enabled the CarPlay in my settings. Also, I removed my iPhone as a device from the connection in my car. So all these basic things, even rebooting my iPhone, I tried all of these. Nothing worked. Only one thing worked for me. Before I could tell you that what it was, first let me tell you when this error starts occurring on your iPhone or in your CarPlay. So basically what happens, I am sharing my experience. So whenever I used to enter my car and just put my key and just turn on the car, not starting the car, just turn on the car. That time what used to happen, the dashboard system used to get activated or turned on. Automatically my iPhone was getting connected through CarPlay to my car, right? So whenever you turn on the car, automatically the CarPlay gets connected. After that, what to do? Then I used to start the car, means ignite the car. That time everything for a second goes on a reboot. That time the system and everything shuts down and restarts again, right? That time the connection between the CarPlay system and the iPhone was getting broken or disabled and after that it was completely blank so sometimes the carplay connection would resume as it is otherwise no so again you have to go to the system tap on it tap on connect and then connect your iphone when i tried that when i used to try that that time this error used to occur so basically first what was happening automatically the carplay was activated or connected on my iphone and when I was starting my car or giving an ignition, that time the CarPlay was rebooting. And that time the error was happening on my iPhone and the CarPlay. So what I did, I tried multiple solutions, didn't work. So I just kept my phone. After 10 minutes, automatically my CarPlay worked and my iPhone got connected to the CarPlay just like that. So this issue might be a bug or a glitch with a software update. Now currently after iOS 18.5 it is not happening. But that time I had installed iOS 18.4 on my iPhone. And that time the CarPlay issue was majorly spoken over the internet. So I think that was the update issue or iOS issue. The bug or a glitch might be and they might get fixed in coming days. So if you currently facing this issue, just do one thing, try this what I tried, otherwise update your software and you can try multiple things what I tried, one thing might work. But otherwise just leave your phone aside for 10 to 15 minutes, this might work on you. So guys that's it, I hope this video was helpful for you and I request you please comment below if there are any other CarPlay issues you are facing and how you fix them so even i could know about them even the other audiences until then i hope you like this video and if yes please give a like and subscribe until then thank you very much bye bye see you in the next video